hi guys welcome to my channel in this video we are going to solve a question is about the water resources engineering course and the subject will be a drainage and so let's read the question and solve it the spacing between the two successive tile drains is 90 meter the depth of the drains is 2 meter below the ground surface take d is 7 meter and r0 is equal to 0 0.125 meter and k is equal to 0.8 meter per day and mu is equal to 0.05 and q is equal to 2 millimeter per day so what is the steady state depth of the water below the ground surface this will be solved due to Hugo's methods okay sorry Hugo's equation so let's solve the question for part a First, I'm gonna I'm gonna obtain the d over l value. Okay, what is d over l? D is seven, and l is ninety, and this will be equal to 0 0.077. It is smaller than 0 0.31, and we greater than O. So we are going to use the depth of equivalent formula is equal to d over one plus d over l multiplied 2.55 multiplied ln d over r0 minus c and let's so uh, let's obtain the value of c also what is c let's write it here what is c 3.55 minus 1.6 multiplied d over l and plus 2 multiplied d over l square okay so uh, for c will be equal to for c90 will be equal to 3.55 minus 1.6 multiplied d over l what is d over l 0 0.077 right 0 0.077 plus 2 multiplied 0 0.077 square and c will be equal to 3.43 and now this is the value of c so now let's find the depth of equivalence this is 7 d over 1 plus 0 0.77 actually we can write it we don't need to write like that so 2.55 multiplied ln d what is d 7 over r0 r0 here 0 0.0.125 0 .125 and minus 3.43 right so depth of equivalence from this equation will be 4.58 as meter this is the depth of equivalent now we can see here so let's find the uh, we find the depth of equivalent so let's find the um, actually the h so we're going to obtain the value of h and we are going to determine the steady state of a uh, groundwater table the depth of the groundwater table so let's find it we have an l value as is given so we are going to write it as the formulation of l 90 square equal to 4 multiplied k what is k or 0.8 and multiplied in the parentheses this is going to be d 4.58 plus h square and minus da oh sorry what is da 4.58 right 4.58 also square and over the value of q what is q look at here this is two millimeters so we are going to divide 100 to convert it meter and so it's going to be 0 0.002 and when i uh, so when i when i take out the h from this uh, formulation i'm going to obtain h here as 0. 52 meter this is the the value of h so let's 
check what is the depth of drains. Depth of drains is 2 meter here, you can see in the question is given. So 2 meter minus this depth, this is d is equal to t, 2 meter, okay? So when I uh, subtract from the 0.52, I'm going to obtain the steady state depth of groundwater table. So 2 minus 0.52. And I'm going to obtain 1.48 meter. This is the steady state of groundwater table. So now the first part is solved. So let's solve the second part. For the second part, this is unsteady condition. Okay. So for the unsteady condition, we have a time. Look at the question. It says find the lowering of the water table 12 days after each irrigation. The groundwater table is 1.2 meter below the ground surface after each irrigation. So we have a formulation like this. H2, sorry, HT over H0 equal to 1.16 exponent and this will be minus p square, sorry, pi square, multiply k and multiply dA and multiply t, the time of is, will be used, okay? So, and we have a mu and multiply L square. And for this question, let's check it. This is ht and delta h delta h plus ht is equal to h0 okay is equal to h0 look at the question it says the irrigation the, sorry the groundwater table is 1.2 meter below the ground surface after each irrigation so 2 meter depth of drains minus 1.2 meter after each irrigation so from that point until that point okay this is going to be Sorry, from this point, it's from the ground surface until that point is 1.2. So uh, H0 will be equal to 0.8, right? This is H0. So let's write the H0 its own place and make this calculation. We are going to obtain HT. So HT or H0 0.8 equal to 1.16. Minus pi square multiplied 0.8 multiplied 4.58 and uh, multiplied 12 days because it's written as 12 days and uh, over mu. What is mu? Let's check. It's 0.05 and multiplied 90 squared the length. Okay, the length of between two drains. So from this, I'm going to obtain ht is equal to 0.32 meter now i obtained h2 sorry ht so if i obtain ht if i obtain ht so i actually need to obtain ht then i'm going to subtract from the two from the ground surface to the drains and i'm going to obtain the lowering of the water table okay so two minus ht is 0.32 I'm going to obtain 1.68 meter. After 12 days irrigation, the groundwater table will reach at, will, sorry, will go down at the 1.68 meter. Okay. Now the question is solved. Thank you for watching. If you like these videos, if you want to see more of the videos, please subscribe and share with your friends. If I did something wrong, please warn me. I'm going to fix it. Thank you, watching. Thank you for watching. See you for the next question.